Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I am so excited because I finally got my hands on something that I've been wanting from Petunia Picklebottom. If you already saw the title, you guys already know. I'm going to try to do a little bit of a comparison of the other item cooling products that they also carry. I do want to mention um, nothing in this video was actually sent to me. I purchased everything with my own moolah. So let's go ahead and get into it. Grab your cafecito. Oh, I love me some pumpkin coffee. All right, let's get into it. All right, if you guys have been here for a while, I do have a full Petunia Pickle Bottom playlist, so I will link that down below. Um, so I already have the um, Sink Carbon Stitch print, um, and what I needed to pick up was this beauty. So this is a tote lunch bag, basically. Um, it is actually fully packed right now. Um, and you guys, I did not know it was going to be this big, if I'm being honest. So I normally use my, you know, my cooler pixel or my cooler pixel plus I have a lot of prints. You guys know, I love those. Um, so I, did, when I got this one, I, when I got it and I opened the box, I was like, Oh, you big, you big. <laughs> um, I'm so excited. Um, I literally filled this up as if it was a, a mini book bag or a sling, not just a lunch item. So if I was, you know, lunch uh, for work or anything like that, it would be different. But I don't work right now. I'm a stay at home mom right now, freelance and other stuff on the side. But I'm currently a stay at home mom. So this is literally going to be like my nice little go-to when I'm just taking a stroller and I don't want to carry anything on my back since my toddler likes being attached to my hip. Anyways, I am going to show you a size comparison with the sling and with the mini boot bag. And of course, with those um, two pixels, um, cooler pixels, and I'll show you packing those really quickly versus this one. So if you like videos like this, please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And thumbs up if you haven't already. Every comment and every single subscriber, every single like means absolutely everything to me. I'm so excited. So let's go ahead and get into the review. All right, guys, let's go ahead and start out with the Cool Pixel Plus. It is very simple. I'll have the measurements on the screen, uh, but it has a logo right here and nice a little handle. Um, I love it because it is super duper flexible um, and it's very easy to store as well. And then it does have a one sided pull. And you see you have a lot of room to throw stuff in. I am going to quickly show you what I fill in there um, when I do use it. Um, so I do have a snack bento box. As you can see, it fits in there perfectly. Um, you can also put it this way. It just will give you a little bit more, you know, it will kind of see it on the top. Um, you can also throw in a juice in here. there and if you wanted to sandwich um these are all empty just for review purposes um but yeah throw that in there and you are ready to go i absolutely love this one i throw this one inside um my diaper bags all the time um it's honestly my favorite size um even though it is the smaller one i feel like i can fit so much in it all right and this is a cooler pixel plus it is quite a bigger you can see right here um it is that much bigger <laughs> than the other one um but i absolutely love this one as well it has the logo um all of them have you know different color logos and prints um the other one also has different prints um this one i do love that it actually has double pull um that is actually really important to me so i actually really really love that and when you open it it is very very deep in here now in this one i can easily put one of these guys in there i can actually put two if i wanted to and i can also put her 10 ounce water bottle in here um and then you kind of still have room here um if you wanted to put a juice <laughs> in there or um i wonder if you can actually fit another water bottle oh you can it's a little tight but you can um i don't know how cozy it will be oh yep i can still close it and it's actually not that hard to close either little thing is there but yeah <laughs> it's a little deformed but you can close it um let's go ahead and take that out 
two water bottles. You can put four water bottles. I put frozen water bottles in there as well. You can also put the snack dental box in there. Um, sandwich box in there. Another snack one if you wanted. Um, still got quite a bit of room. Juice. Some more snacks. Honestly, you could just throw so much in this one. Um, I do, again, I said I love this one too. Um, this, I usually stick it to my stroller with the hook. With the hook, I love this thing. I just attach it to a stroller here and I'm ready to go. Um, but this is the Pixel Plus. Again, I do very much enjoy these as well. I really wanted to know the size comparison to the cooler pixel the cooler pixel plus and the new tote that came out and oh my goodness it's a big difference and here are the size comparison also with the mini backpack and also the sling all right so and then on the sides here there is nothing back here it's a nice soft canvas one thing i wish i had right off the bat is i wish it had rings on the sides so I can carry this as a purse because um, I can so see myself carrying this by itself um, just because of how versatile and the size of it. Um, so there's, there is no double pull on this one. There is just one pull. Um, another cool feature though is that it has this. I don't even need to take my hook when I carry this around. I just kind of pop it in here, snap it to the stroller, and we are good to go. Um, let's go ahead and open it up. It is obviously insulated, as you can see, um, and it is quite big and spacious inside. I really like that it has a mesh pocket back here because I could throw other stuff in there if I needed to. Silverware, tissue, hand sanitizer, or anything like that. Um, but I really, really like the way this bag looks. Let's go ahead and fill it up with stuff I would probably take. <laughs> All right, so if I'm packing this for lunch, I'm going to go ahead and put my pencil box in there, my daughter's. That is actually my daughter's, and it fits in there perfectly with so much room to spare. Um, I'm actually going to put her water bottle, her 12-ounce water bottle, right next to it. Um, then I'm going to go ahead and put a sandwich little container. Um, I'm going to throw her little snack pouch that's normally in the diaper bag in there. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna throw some juice in there as well, just like that, I have a lot of room. Um, let's pretend this has more snacks in there, oh my goodness, you see? Um, and I still have room to even throw something up here if I really wanted to, so I'm gonna pretend this is, has something in it. Right up there, I could even put wipes or something in there, but yeah, it fits quite a bit in there. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm actually going to pack it like if I am going to use that as my only bag that I'm going to carry. So if you guys watch my videos, you guys know I don't leave anywhere with the antibacterial wipes for your hands and Clorox wipes. So I'm actually going to place it right back here. Just like that. Um, I also don't like leaving my house without my daughter's um, mealtime plate that has disposable spoons. Um, there's actually a placemat and stickers and her fork and spoon. And I'm actually going to put it right back here. Just like that. Then I'm going to go ahead and put um, my wristlet that has diapers and her wipes, which actually fit in there like nothing. Um, then I'm actually going to throw in her 10 ounce water bottle still have room in there so i'm actually going to throw in her little snack pouch in here as well just like that and if you could even tell i can actually throw something else in here if i wanted to um <laughs> so why not let's just throw her water bottle her juice in there Oh, look at that it's it's perfect like and it's not even hard to close and I could just go out with just this and it has everything we will need I almost forgot my handy dandy 
Neosporin and bandages. There we go. Now we can go. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Again, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to check out my Petunia Pickle bottom playlist. <laughs> and if you guys do purchase anything using the link below, I do get a very small commission, which I am beyond grateful for. This helps my channel very much because I can actually be able to purchase things for more content. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.